Kyla is a really good soldier, um, partly because of her upbringing. She's grown up in an insurrectionist war zone and she's very used to and aware of and motivated by that conflict, I think. Um, she's also like physically capable and pretty badass, but I think it's that like mental drive that she has that she totally believes in the UNSC cause. She's really committed to being at Corbulo. She really wants to be the best. Um, that means that she does get the fastest drill times and uh, is pretty in control during training exercises. Uh, so yeah, she's a pretty together cadet. This story is about a group of cadets at the UNSC Military Academy, Corbulo, and it takes place just sort of around the start of conflict with the Covenant. Um, these cadets are just training to fight insurrectionists. They don't know about aliens and things. And uh, it's kind of about their group and individual journeys when the war with the Covenant breaks out, um, their encounter with Master Chief and their race for survival as their planet is destroyed. <laughs> Master Chief is this inspirational super soldier and it's a really, I mean, he's a really important character in the context of Halo because I think he's also a character that fans feel they have a lot of ownership of. I think I'm right in saying that you can play Master Chief. So it's very important that he's like an everyman character at the same time as being freaking awesome. Daniel's so nice and he's so tolerant because he really has a pretty uncomfortable job to do in that suit. Um, I mean, physically, he's a pretty impressive guy and all the cadets, all the actors playing the cadets are quite short. So standing next to him, we really look teeny. He's pretty tall. Uh, I mean, what he's doing in this is that he's an incredibly talented physical actor. He's having to do a lot of stunts and the way that he moves is very important. I think one of the things I like most about the way he works is that he's a very good balance between being open and knowing exactly what he wants. So if you come in and say, please can we change this line, please can I try this, he's totally up for it. But when you're under pressure and you need to get something done and you say what do you want, he'll give you a very specific and straight answer. Um, which is great, which is uh, exactly how I like to work, so it's great.